Hey what is up everyone this is Kiran here welcome back to Tech Kiran YouTube channel this is something different a unique UI based customer which we have installed on our Redmi Note 9 Pro it's a mere tool build so it can be installed on Redmi Note 9s, Redmi Note 9 Pro, Redmi Note 9 Pro Max and Poco M2 Pro the room called X-Droid and I'm using it from some time didn't got any kind of major issues room seems to be quite good enough and here this is the UI which you get in settings setting seems to be different enough here but everything else seems to be same as it's based on pixel one so normal default black wallpaper you get here also one of the things which I have noticed let me just open this Google Assistant as you can see Google keeps stopping I haven't updated the Google app yet so I'm not sure if it is from Google there or without updating that app but yes this is that which I got performance seems to be decent enough you can use this build on your device as your daily driver if you want to I didn't got any kind of major bugs till now and might be other updates very very soon talking about the default launcher as you can see it comes with this pixel launcher and here this is the app opening and app closing animations animations are quite smooth and as expectedly there are no lags and nothing to talk about quick settings it's sicta 2 by 3 is the default layout which you cannot customize by the way it doesn't come with any kind of major customizations for you in the terms of home settings yes it comes with the pixel launcher it's almost pixel device base or pixel os but compared to the pixel os which i just made a video some days ago that was quite quite a great great compared to this one google camera go edition is the pre-installed google camera and yes if you want to use the normal main google camera you can i tried that that was working quite good in the terms of performance tests or basically CPU throttling, um, it's good, it's quite good, no CPU throt thermal throttling detected, but it's almost same in all the Cortana based custom rooms, whenever I use almost all custom rooms in Cortana, seems to be decent enough, but yes, as I always say, the real performance is what actually matters and compared to other custom rooms, the performance seems to be normal, it's not that great, but it's not that bad though, in the terms of certificate of L1 or L3, what is the certificate which we have it comes with the l3 so yes no netflix hd no amazon prime hd unfortunately for you but yes maybe you might get l1 because i saw some users who are getting l1 i'm not sure why why i'm not getting but yes this is what i'm getting right now in the terms of battery backup related things more than one hour off screen on time with eight percent of battery drainage with approximately 6% battery drainage per hour, it's not bad of course, it's 60 hertz compared to 120 hertz, it's awesome, but yes, it's good enough, idle rain was not too much, so yes, in the terms of battery backup seems to be good enough, as it was expected by the way, because it's pixel experience, it's based on pixel experience, so these rooms always comes with good kind of battery backup, these are some customizations options you get here, X, Z, R, Y, P, R, I'm not sure what it is, but yes, it comes with some bit of customizations for you. For example, in status bar, you can customize the clock related settings. It's up to you if you want to customize like show seconds, AM, PM style, etc. Like this, if you go back and want to check out traffic indicator, it's already included. Some users want network speed meter in the status bar. The option is available for you. Don't worry about that. Battery related settings were also available in the terms of gestures you can customize a swipe to screenshot is available Which is a very useful feature by the way. So yes, it's available. It's actually quite good in the terms of other options We have all those options in the terms of editing as you can see editing option were there System navigation also includes the gesture navigation and things are all almost same here if you want to check it out Let me show you one more thing if I move on here in the settings you don't have the option of choosing the immerse navigation gesture so yes for that you need to use the magisk model if you want to use it as a daily driver playback control and etc basic options are already present for you miscellaneous etc these are the things you get in this custom this is based on pixel this pixel os or you can say pixel experience kind of the same OS but with some little bit of different UI called Xtroid so these were things I just want to let you know about Xtroid and the link for this build is in the description it comes with the Google Apps pre-installed so you don't need to install them separately and installation is quite same like other custom rooms make sure you have Orange Fox custom recovery install the build format data and you're good to go these were things I just want to let you know link for this build is in the description this is all thanks for watching don't forget to like and share this video. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe me. Goodbye.